Hey, welcome back. I'm Wes with The Income Guy, and today we're talking about minimizing your retirement taxes and maximizing your income. So far, we've talked about how different types of retirement incomes are taxed and looked at some new tax laws and explained how they're going to how to avoid one of the biggest tax risks in retirement. But now, let's look at a few retirement tax strategies you might be able to use every year. You know, for a lot of people, one of the quickest and easiest strategies that you can take advantage of is the higher standard deduction offered by the IRS to taxpayers that are over 65 years old. That's because single filers in that age group are able to increase their standard deduction by $1,700 this year. Joint filers by $2,700. And another strategy you might want to consider involves spousal IRA contributions. Even if you're no longer working but your spouse is working, he or she can contribute up to $7,000 a year to an IRA that you own. And as long as your spouse has earned income to make that contribution, this tax shelter remains open to you. Here's another option. If you become self-employed after you retire, you can deduct the premiums you pay for Medicare Part B and Part D on your taxes. Another popular strategy is to have uh, any payout that you get from a pension or an annuity or other income source sent directly to a rollover IRA instead of going to you. Because if the check from that 401k is made out to the account instead of to you personally, you'll avoid automatically withholding that IRS uh, withholdings there. And again, these are just a few of the strategies that may or may not be right for you. And believe me, I know if you're like most people, including me, you don't enjoy thinking about taxes or talking about taxes, and you certainly don't look forward to tax season and paying taxes. But the bottom line is this. As with so many unpleasant things in life, ignoring your taxes can make them even more unpleasant by increasing the financial burden that they're going to create. And that's especially true when you're retired or getting close to retirement, when smart, proactive financial planning is even more important than ever before. And an advisor who specializes in retirement income can help you create a plan that's just right for you. A plan that uh, minimizes your tax burden, ensures that you can enjoy your retirement with the peace of mind and reliable income. You need to meet all your needs and all your goals that you would like to achieve. But now, here's one more chance to get your copy of my timely and informative report, The Case for Fixed Income, How to Avoid the Common Mistakes That Could Derail Your Retirement. And once again, it's free in your retirement income kit, and you can get one by visiting retiretv.com or by calling 855-776-0614. But now let's welcome back income specialist and the founder of the Retirement Income Store, Dave Scranton. Hello again, Dave. Thanks for coming back. You know, I, it's funny. I find that when you talk to retirees or people really close to retirement who are in a higher bracket and you talk to them about tax-saving strategies, they tend to think about municipal bonds and whereas that is one evergreen strategy and can work for the right person. You know, there are other great tax saving strategies too. Yeah, well, the benefit of a municipal bond for really those folks that are in the high, high income brackets is they can invest into a municipal bond and get the two things that, that are great about a bond. Uh, one is a fixed payment of interest every year and they hold the bond until it matures and they're guaranteed the par value and by the municipality. And they're generally considered a little bit more conservative in most cases than a corporate bond. But as they're generating that interest and in, that interest payment from the bond, uh, it's not taxable. Now, the problem with municipal bonds right now is the rates are pretty low, so it's good to look at all the other types of ways to reduce your taxes in retirement. And one of the things that I didn't bring up in the last segment is with those RMDs. One of the things that we find a lot of people do is they actually give a portion or all of their required distribution directly to their church or to their charity. It's called, it's called a qualified charitable deduction. And the benefit of this is that as they're giving money to their church through the RMD, it, it calculates towards the RMD so the government's happy. Uh, next, the church, the charity gets the money, so it's going to where they want it to go to. But lastly, and the best part of it all, tax-wise, is that they don't have to pay taxes on that RMD anymore. And they get to keep their huge standard deduction. So you got to look at all these different things when you're considering ways to reduce taxes for the right client. Good. Well, it makes sense to me. There's a lot of stuff. But I think what you're trying to say is that there's so much that in some ways, this should be one of these things that you don't, you don't try at home alone. It should be one of those things that's better done with the help of a professional who knows how to coach you around the ins and outs of these. 
Yeah, and an income specialist is really given the, the tools to be able to help um, make recommendations of these types of strategies. I, you know, we find in our industry something called the three blind mice syndrome, meaning that you may have different advisors in your community that are there to help you. But if they're not actively talking and communicating to each other, as a client, they, their clients may get stuck in a mouse trap. Meaning you may have a, a, a tax advisor on one side of town that prepares your income tax return, and then you got a financial advisor or a broker on the other side of town. But if they're not really working together, those investment strategies may be creating a lot of unnecessary taxes, and then the accountant may not understand the investments well enough to advise on what they should do. So an income specialist eliminates that confusion, either by including a tax practice in their firm or just knowing enough about taxes, working with retirees to be able to help their clients reduce their taxes. And when you think about it, if a client is able to reduce taxes or our viewers are able to reduce taxes, well, that just gives more income in their pocket for their family over the, over the long run. And, you know, I'm always, excited to, to show people ways to reduce their taxes because I know nobody wants to pay any more unnecessary taxes than they have to. Yeah, and I've heard you say so many times, Wes, don't wait till March or April to do tax planning. You have to do it several months before the returns due. And the same is true with planning for income. You can't just get to the year before retirement and say, okay, now I'm gonna plan for my retirement income. That plan starts a decade or more before in many ways, does it not? It, it does. It, it starts in what we call the, the red zone. You know, if somebody's goal is to retire at 60, you really got to get after it at 45 or 50. It needs to start years and years ahead of time. And taxes are an important element of it. But as you mentioned, you know, too many people are preparing their income tax return for the year that had just flown by, trying to find out ways to reduce their taxes, and it may be too late. To be able to proactively reduce your taxes in retirement, it needs to be done in the year that you're living in now. So if you want to reduce your taxes for this year, do it now. Don't wait until you're filing a return for next year. But Dave, thank you again as always. Always enjoy our talks here. And um, again, I'm Wes Wood, the Income Guy, and thank you for watching. And if you have any questions about anything we've covered on today's show, reach out to me at retiretv.com or by calling 855-776-0614. Thank you again. Wood Financial Group wants you to have the retirement of your dreams, and that means financial abundance. Knowing retirement can last for over 30 years, our team is focused on providing income-producing strategies so you can live comfortably and worry-free. Though to Middle Tennessee's best investment services company for many years, we will ensure you have abundant income throughout retirement so you can spend more time doing the things you love with the people you love. Wood Financial Group, abundance for life. Hi, I'm Wes Wood, founder of Wood Financial Group. There are hundreds of different ways you can claim your Social Security benefits, but the difference between the best way versus the second best way could be the difference in tens of thousands of dollars over your lifetime. You don't want to miss out on an income stream that can help fund your retirement dreams. Go to retiretv.com to claim your custom Social Security analysis from Wood Financial Group. We can help maximize your Social Security benefits in retirement.